welcome back to some Blood Crest Mary content. Today I find myself over here at BCM and I'm kind of in the middle of some projects. And uh, right now it's a little chilly out here as you can tell how I'm dressed. Inside we have, uh, I have the living room getting warmed up so I can get some painting done in there. And uh, I was kind of just waiting for that to get done. I was piddling around with a couple of little things. And then I decided today would be a pretty good day for a ghost hunt. And it just so happened that I also have my uh, REM pod EMF detector with me. So we've had some success over here with this. And um, I wanted to see if we could get it going again. If these videos kind of pick up, you know, and people start really liking them, I could see getting some other equipment and doing definitely more of them. So if this is the kind of content you like, definitely like, subscribe. Let us know how you think we did in the comments below. All that helps a ton. And uh, recommend us to your friends and watch for your friends. But other than that, let's go ahead and get down to it and see if we can't find some sort of activity today. Boo! All right, everyone. So this is building number one that we're going to be looking at messing with today. Now, as far as the haunt is concerned, not a ton is going to change other than I'm just going to get rid of all this junk that's in here right now. I'm going to do a thorough cleaning up and making sure this floor is good and level. But uh, other than that, it'll pretty much just be a straight shot through here with like some of this going on over here. But let's go ahead and see what we find in here. All right. So we are going. I'll stand like this so you guys can see it. And I can tell you this, it's not 61 out here either. It's probably just more from being in the pocket. But all right. So let's see what we can find out. Is there anyone in here with us? If so, all you have to do is touch this device in my hand and we can hear you and, or not hear you, but at least we'll know you're here. And we'll sit right here on the counter or shelf, whatever you want to call it. Just touch the device, let us know you're here. All you have to do is grab it and put your energy into it and we'll know. Oop, that was me. Sorry. These things are kind of just hanging in the way. They're coat hangers that used to be used to smoke meat in here a long time ago, apparently. If there's anyone in here, make a sound. Knock. Move an object. Shake the beans inside that jar. <laughs> Nothing going on. Seemed pretty quiet. And I gotta admit it, although it does look kind of spooky in here, I don't get any kind of like weird vibes from in here. Like the basement just has this kind of funk to it. You know, a lot of basements are like that, but the basement in there is definitely a little bit more than usual. But out here, I just ain't feeling nothing. Now, remember I do, uh, I did hear like a, a scream out here one night when I was doing a ghost hunt. But we weren't able to get that on the mic, and I can't say for sure where it came from or what caused it. Nothing in here. I want to move on. If you wish to speak, all you have to do is touch this device, and we can start asking some questions. I guess not in here, guys. Which I'm not necessarily shocked by. I'm just kind of starting here because it's the first one in line. So let's go ahead and I'll uh, pick it back up to you guys in just a moment over in the chicken coop. Ooh. All right, we have made it to the chicken coop. My hands are filled. I'm bringing this along with us just in case. Go ahead and turn off the rim pod for now. I'm bringing this along with me so that way I can set it up and uh, catch some decent angles. But uh, this is definitely not the easiest place to get in and out of. All right. We've made it in here by no easy means. Now I will say this room or this place feels a little bit more uneasy than the shed does. So let's see what we can find out. Is there any spirits in here with us? I'd like to make themselves known. Just touch the device in my hand and we will see it. Oh, right there. Is 
Is there anyone in here with us? By us, I mean me and my camera. <laughs> Touch the device in my hand and let yourself be known. Anyone know who built this place? Is that person still here? Make a knock. Make a sound. Knock something over. No, I heard that. You in the back room? Boy, it's pretty good. Touch the device right here on the counter. Let us know that you're here. Alright, advice and no luck so far. At least none that I've seen. Maybe the other camera picked something up that I didn't see or heard something I didn't hear, but currently I haven't had anything unexplainable yet so we're gonna go into the old homestead here now this building I would love absolutely love to use for the haunt but I just don't foresee it surviving very much longer on its own I mean even if you were to come in here and do some work to it to try to save it I just don't see it going down that way Let's see, you can already tell it's really leaning. Supposedly they used uh, this over here as like a garage for their tractor at one point. And that over there was attached to it. You can kind of see it through the woods. I mean, but I mean, at the very least, we get to go ahead and walk through here and see how cool this is. So here we go. I mean, look at this thing. Honestly, this thing could come down right now on me and, and it wouldn't shock me too bad. I mean, this thing is a sneeze away. I don't know if you guys heard that or not, but I heard what was almost a definitive footstep behind me. Like in the leaves. Well, maybe that's a good sign. If there's any spirits here, Allow me to just say I'm the new owner of the property and I'm here to try to communicate with you so we can get a better understanding of your story and what's going on here. If you wish to communicate, I have this right here, this device leaned up against the wall. All you gotta do is come over here and put your energy to it and it will let us know you're here. Is the person who built this still here? Do they know how it was built? Who built it? Can you make a sound and let me know you're here? Someone left an old, old sink back in here. You can tell how this was a, possibly a little shed or living quarters at one point. I wanna say uh, the, the people said that it was a 
they used this right over here to store a tractor. And maybe this was like a workshop or something. I've been calling it the original homestead, but I'm not too, too sure. I can tell you I like the metal up there, though. I'll be definitely using that. Come on now. Knock something over. Let me know you... Not, <laughs> don't knock the building over, but knock on something to let me know you're here. I'm not going to lie. I'm a little bit nervous to walk on that. Because that seems to be connected to these walls. And I definitely don't want to be putting any type of strain or sway on these walls. I do not want to be in here when this thing decides to come Humpty Dumpty in it down. Whoa. Just as I turn the camera back on. Do that again. There you go. Do that again. Excellent. Are you the one who built this house? Touch the device in my hand if you are. Do you know who built it? Oh, you do. Are you angry that you're still here? Touch the device in my hand if you are. What? The device just shut off. Well, we're getting some good readings. Are you mad that you're here? If you want to talk to us, touch the device in the hand. Or in my hand. That's crazy. I was just about to turn the camera back on. Just getting it turned on. Up. Oh, there you are. There you are. Don't go anywhere. Now, do you know your name? How do you feel about this place being turned into an attraction? A haunted house attraction. Do you like the idea of that? Do you like the idea that multiple people will get to come through here and see your land? Touch the device in my hand if you'd just like to be left alone. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and guess that's a good indicator. That you'd prefer to be left in here. Yep, I see you. Is there any type of message you would like to get across? That you would like to be known about you? If so, just touch the device in my hand. Do you like having the opportunity to speak like this? Being able to uh, have a conversation? Are you one of the previous owners who used to live here? If so, touch the device right here. All right, everyone, so that's going to be all for the day. Um, I don't have a ton more time to continue doing this. Uh, I know we were getting some pings there toward the end, but... Uh, I just don't have no more time to wait. I have to go ahead and get onto my work and get done before the day's out. But uh, other than that, everyone, if you want to see more ghost content like this, definitely let us know in the comments. Like, subscribe, share it with your friends. I'm more than happy to start buying some different type of ghost equipment and trying different things and going to different places. Just let me know if that's something you all would like to see, and uh, we'll definitely make it happen. So without further ado, everyone, I'll be talking to you here next time. Boop.